All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Marcus Summers, a.k.a. Major Lennox. I'm coming to you to let you know that it's over. It's over. Actually, it's been over for over 24 hours now. It's um, actually Monday. wanted to do this Sunday, but I was dead ass tired. I, I couldn't do it. There was just no, no possible way. Um, of course, I'm talking about um, the Extra Life 24-hour video gaming marathon, which happened... Um, Saturday and Sunday, sorry my nose itches. Um, um, definitely, like I said, the event was a blast. Um, I definitely have some videos that will be put up, I'm not sure, before or after this one. Um, showing some of the stuff that I was working on, some of the stuff I was playing, and actually showing a couple of other people playing some games as well. Um, also, there's some pictures you can go to major views, uh, majorvisions.com. Um, I'll have a link to that website in the description below. Um, but yeah, neither here nor there. That's not what I'm here to talk about. Today, I'm actually here to talk about giving thanks. I want to give thanks to those people who have helped out during the event. Um, like I said, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen me tweet, post on Facebook, LinkedIn, God knows wherever I posted, emailed. I was looking for donations. Um, I had a goal of $200 which two weeks ago I actually met. Then I reset the goal. I upped it up, I put it up 50%, so I was looking for 300. And with almost within 48 hours, that goal was met as well. And I'm just like truly blessed that that actually happened. Um, also a little bit more math. I know in count videos, I'm not very good at math. Um, <laughs> when crunching the numbers after I hit the $300 um, goal, I had noticed that this year I had more than doubled the uh, raised more than double the amount that I had raised in the three years prior. So, and I think it was 2011, I raised $25. In 2012, I raised $50. In 2013, I raised $60. That in total is $135. This year I raised three hundred dollars and four cents. So yeah, the math works out. That's over twice in one year alone, more than double. And I've got nobody to thank but you guys. Also, I would like to report too that I actually made it the entire twenty-four hours, which I haven't done in three years. So I especially want to thank you guys for motivating me and just that just providing me that push to actually do this for the first time and why I was so exhausted yesterday but I do want to give the shouts out to those who did donate or at least those who actually gave names um first which is um David Whelan aka Tiny415 from the Game Enthuse podcast um also Michael Cap Calvert sorry um uh, Assault Suit and Mr. Aaron B also known as indifference thank you thank you for um donating i do appreciate it um do want to give a thanks out to my mom who donated 25 dollars for from the first email i actually helped her out with that one and then when i sent out a second email thinking that i was asking her to do it again donated yet another 25 dollars so i do appreciate my mom for doing that even though you know i might have tricked her I don't, I don't want to say I tricked her, but, you know, the, the emails weren't clear. They weren't. I definitely want to give a shout out to uh, Mr. Donnie G, Gen DV 138 um, of Game Enthuse, Friendom, Fame. Do appreciate that as well. Uh, but in this one, this one here means a lot to me. Um, it's There is no name. There is no name. And like I know I've talked about before on the podcast MSE. I mentioned it when it happened. Um, this guy, he, like I said, I don't know, this guy, girl, who knows? I don't know. The, the, the fact is, this is an anonymous donor who, when I tweeted out that day, that, hey, I am just it's like so many percent short of my goal. You guys should help out. If somebody come help out, this guy single hand, this person single handedly donates the rest of my goal. He capped. This person, he almost, I'm, okay, I'm just going to say he, I know it may be sexist, 
I, I understand that. But just for the sake of argument, because it, it does seem easier. It, it does seem easier, and I know that's lazy. But this person single-handedly just finished off the door, just topped it right on off. And I was ha like I mean, I was having a bad day that day. And just getting that, um, just getting, like I said, actually it didn't, like I said, didn't notify me, the, the extra didn't even notify me that I got the, um, the donation. They told me, hey, you qualify for this shirt here. I'm like, hmm, I don't understand why. That's like $200. Like, you have to raise $200 to get that shirt. I haven't raised $200, but then going to see that somebody actually did finish that off and got me to the $200 mark. I thought it was pretty awesome and like whoever that is, he, she, whoever, I definitely appreciate it. Like I said, I mean, if you want to come forward, sure, if you want to come forward in private and don't want to let me know who, like you, if you don't want to let other people know who you are, I, whatever, if you don't want to let me know, that's fine. All of those, I just hope God blesses you in a special way. Because you just made me feel, you helped me feel better on a bad day. Um, definitely want to give a shout out to actually one of the Extra Life Guild members here in the Raleigh Jump area, Steve Sober. He helped me out. Um, he was one of the first people to donate when I raised the go up $300. Also, the Mrs. Miss Tiffany Lennox helped out as well, and I do appreciate it, and I love her so much, and that actually just made me feel good when she helped out as well. Give a shout out to Lisa Cascani, Casarini, I'm sorry, my, my eye, the, the screen, the, the, the text on here is like really, really small, and it's sitting a distance away, so give me a second. It's Lisa Cascarini. I do appreciate that as well. I'm good friends on Twitter. Like so we talk back and forth. Very inspir um share inspiring inspirational and kind words to each other. Um definitely a good friend to have. Um I do appreciate it. I appreciate your help so much. Um but yeah, so these are the people who have definitely helped out. Like I said, I'm like I said, this is just a small thing that I can small gesture I can do for appreciation, um, on behalf of helping me out reach the goal. Um, but yeah, that's about it. I do, like I said, again, I just want to um, give a shout out to people who did donate this year. Um, it's still not too late to donate. You can still go to donate.majorshouse.com. Excuse me, that should take you to my um, Extra Life donation page where you can definitely drop in a couple of bucks if you so please. If not, I'm not asking you to do anything that you normally wouldn't do, but please go out, help somebody. Um, it's, there's actually a video I posted, um, I exported from Twitch where I was talking to somebody and he said that he couldn't donate, but he said he paid for it. And like, that's all I asked for is just to be kind at least like donating money is one way of sitting helping somebody to help move our society forward. Another thing is actually just be kind to one another, like all the senseless anger and animosity that we see out there today. It's... It's senseless. Like the best way to sit there and calm a situation down and bring people together is actually to be nice and kind to one another. And it was great to see that just online. Um, I definitely do want to give thanks to the people who were on that Twitch stream, which you can't find on YouTube. Um, also includes me at like seven o'clock in the well, no, not seven. It was about eight, about eight o'clock in the morning, giving a pseudo sermon um, about trying to finish extra life which i found very hilarious but um definitely yeah, give that um look at too i'll probably put some link to that in the description as well um but again i'm rambling um again it's just a big thanks to those who did help out this um this year with extra life and i hope that we can all do this again next year see you